Robert Owen's Social Reform, New Lanark. The village of New Lanark in southern Scotland was built next to a spinning mill. At the end of the 18th century, during the Industrial Revolution, spinning mills were powered by river water. A large housing complex for workers was built near the New Lanark Mills and housed some 2,500 employees. This house was built for the mill owner, who arrived here in 1800. Robert Owen was a social reformer. He invested profits from the mill to improve the lives of workers. These shops were part of his improvement plan. Owen purchased items in bulk at a discount price and then sold them at a modest profit to the mill workers. This system was later developed into the consumer cooperative system. When Owen arrived here, people were working under very harsh conditions. In those days, it was not unusual for workers to labour from dawn until midnight. Owen shortened the working day to 10 hours. Young children also had to work. They picked up yarn waste in an extremely dusty environment. Owen prevented young children under the age of 10 from working. He also set up a medical institution and a school for his workers to use for free. The classroom has been restored to its original condition and it's now open to visitors. Owen believed that education should start as early as possible and the school accepted any child between the age of 18 months and 12 years. In 1816, there were 14 teachers and 274 pupils at the school. Owen's reforms opened the way to a social revolution that prompted new labour law legislation to protect workers. And it also supported the formation of labour unions.